I'm picking gooseberries. This is really the first time I've ever picked them. I've picked a few now and then, but uh, I never covered them up before, and the birds would always get them before I realized they were ripe. So this year I covered them up with netting, and they're covered. There's quite a few on here, and I've heard people, diff different people comment, they're ripe when they're green, or they're ripe when they're, you know, pale, red, purple. Well, these are red and purple, and I believe they are ready to pick. And there's a few coming off, you know, and ripe ones with the ripe ones, but I think that's okay. It's just like when you're picking berries or grapes, you get a few that's not so ripe as the others. And uh, they say you can make cobblers out of them and I think jams on jellies and old lady said dumplings and gooseberry pie so I'm going to pick them and see what I can do with these this year do you have any recipes you want to share or do you you know know what else you can do with them now, I did hear you could freeze them, just like regular berries, until you do use them. So, the only other thing I used to know about gooseberries was, when you buy fruit cocktail, I always loved the gooseberries. That was my favorite thing in there. So, I was talking about it one time, and my girlfriend said, well, I've got some gooseberry plants. And, you know, they used to be, I think she said, on her grandma's land. And uh, so she brought me out a bush. And I planted it. And it's really gotten big, as you can see. And getting quite a few berries on it this year. And there's a, there's a blackberry uh, bush in here with it, too. So I just leave them. But the blackberries, as you can see, they're still green. We haven't had the best weather in the world this this spring and early summer. It's either cold or hot or we're having a drought or we're having, you know, a big wet smell. But I saw all these beautiful red and purplish looking gooseberries and I thought I need to pick those. So that's, that's what I'm doing right now. And uh, like I said, if any of you have any ideas or recipes to share please do so and if if you like this video just like it please like it and subscribe I've got a lot of other food videos on my site if you want to check them out but these just look so neat and they're slightly just very slightly soft to the touch and that's one way someone else said that, to tell if they're ripe or not and, uh, well, I'm out here in, in the drizzle this morning picking blueberries. I mean, not, pick, not picking blueberries, even though I do have some blueberries to pick. They're getting ripe right now, too. So I guess that's why I said that, picking my gooseberries this morning.